All in, lights on, ready to go. Set for race two. And they're off. Racing in the second and getting away down on the inside. Touch of Barley shows a bit of dash here. And with Antique Lace and Cohito in the middle, they go out in the lead from Balladell. And then Denise's pride and Decath has drifted to the rear of the field. And uh, where is Ginger Mule? Can't see it. Uh, so it might be still back behind them. I can't see it come out with them. So it's Touch of Barley in front in second placing at the moment. On the outside is Cohito. Belladell is racing third, Antique Lace is fourth on the outside of Denise's Pride and five away to Decat and Ginger Mule may have stayed in the barrier, I can't see it in the field. Into the straight and the leader is still Belladell. Got a little kick here. Now on the outside, Cajito is out after it. They were followed by Touch of Bali, whacking away. And coming through the middle then came Denise's pride, but it's all Belladell down the hard straight, and Belladell is going to romp in. Belladell first. Or oh, Denise's pride might have got the bob in for second over Cajito, then Touch of Bali, not a bad run. And they were followed by Antique Lace, and uh, then came Decath, and hold all tickets because I'm not too sure what happened to Ginger Mule. I'll find out shortly for you, but it's back at the barriers. They're just trying to find out what happened to Ginger Mule, but Belladell, Warren Power, a genius on fire. Two out of two. <laughs> Blue Cattle, Blue Cattle, Blue Cattle, Blue Cattle, Okay, the uh, starter has said that the horse turned its head in the barrier, Ginger Mule, and didn't jump with the field. So it looks as though it will be declared a runner. Turned its head in the barrier and did not, did not jump with the field. So no doubt they'll... Okay, mate, and the deduction anyway of uh, my sister sell too. Okay. So there'll also be a delay uh, because they'll view the start to make sure Ginger Mule affected a uh, wasn't uh, interfered with it. Plus there'll be delay as the, the uh, deductions will be for my sister's cell, which was scratched at 2:20. I'll have further details shortly. We'll get the numbers for you in a moment. Okay, uh, numbers are five, two, four, eight, and one. Five, two, four, and eight. One was fifth. Five and a quarter by a half a head. 103.26 the time. Five, the winner, Belladell, Scotty Sheargold, and uh, Ralphie Baker. Pretty happy there, one and easy. Winning the Eric Baker Memorial. So uh, we mentioned that's his brother. And great to win that. Two, Denise's Pride, Graham Fleecy, and Bones Bailey gets second. Number four, Cajito, Pietro Romeo, and Scotty Cooper gets third. And fourth was number eight, which was Touch of Barley for uh, Peter Rowe and Massa Arbe. I reckon uh, Rowe would be happy with that effort. Today and number one, Antique Lace finished fifth. So it was five, two, four, eight, one. Now the margin, pretty big. Horses won by five and a quarter lengths by a half a head. 
in 103.26 the time. I'll uh, get the deductions and uh, they're going to have a look at the start of the race just to make sure since the uh, wasn't denied a fair start. So we'll have a look at that. I'll get back, when the stewards get back to me, I'll get back to you.